What's good? I'm back with my first fashion video of the year, sisters. In today's video, I'm showing you all of the outfits that I wore last week. I had lots of fun, did lots of activities, and I looked good doing them. <laughs> Thank you so much, Monica Vinader, for sponsoring today's video. And let's get started. Sunday was a very exciting day for me. I went to the Rose Bowl flea market for the first time. I've lived in Los Angeles for half of my life and this is my first time going. <laughs> Don't judge me. So my friends and I bought tickets for 9 a.m. and LA in the morning is pretty cold, especially in the valley. So this is the look this morning. Let's talk about the base layer first. I'm wearing this cotton knit sweater from Polo Ralph Lauren. Side note, this sweater is very popular with men for some reason. Like every single time I wear this sweater, a man compliments it. I don't know what it is, but it's cozy. It's very cute. And what matters most is that I love it. <laughs> For the bottoms, I'm wearing these trousers from Uniqlo. These are my favorite trousers right now. I really like the way that they fall on the body and I'm a huge fan of pleats on trousers and they're very easy to wash. I'm done with dry clean only clothing in 2024. I'm just not doing it anymore, y'all. These are my new Adidas that I got as a Christmas gift from my aunt and uncle when I visited them in DC. Thank you, Aunt Mary and Uncle Casey. And then I threw on this faux shearling jacket because it was so cold. And to match the color palette of the outfit, I put on this brown satchel crossbody from Fossil. These two rings are from a brand called Monica Vinader. You've probably come across them on Instagram. They use only recycled gold vermeil, sterling silver, and sustainably sourced natural gemstones. The first ring style that I'm wearing here is the 18 karat gold vermeil Dea domed ring. I love the texture and unevenness of this ring. It's not just a smooth, plain band. The irregularities give it a lot of character and depth, which I love. The second ring style that I'm wearing is a Kate Young gemstone ring in 18K gold vermeil and green onyx. I've really been loving green lately and that extends to my jewelry. I love jade and green onyx and emerald is my birthstone. So I decided to show some green pride with this ring. You know what I'm saying? It's bold and I love that it really makes a statement. If you're interested in any of the jewelry that I'll be featuring in this video, I will link everything in the description box down below. And you can use code AsiaJ20 to get 20% off your entire purchase. Now that's pretty exciting, folks. Now what made this day extra exciting is that I also played golf for the first time. We did go to a golf club and I didn't wanna wear street clothes. I wanted to wear a golf club appropriate attire. This top is actually part of a set from Lacoste. It came with a skirt, but it was way too cold to wear the skirt. So I ended up just wearing the pants that I wore to the flea market. And honestly, they look like golf pants anyway, so it worked out perfectly. I didn't actually wear this brown belt on the day because I didn't think that I would be wearing pants, but when filming this video, something was missing aesthetically from this outfit, so I just threw on this brown belt that I got from Nordstrom. And again, I'm wearing my Adidas sneakers. This was a deliberate choice. The colors on my shoes match the colors on my top, so everything was just working out for me on Sunday. I just had a fantastic day. <laughs> On Monday, I went to the gym with my friend Christine, which is the same friend that took me golfing yesterday. My gym actually has a co-working space, so after we worked out, we went up there with our laptops and did some work. I wanted to wear something cozy but still chic, and this is one of my go-to outfit formulas specifically for that criteria. So for the base layer, I'm wearing this basic ribbed long sleeve shirt from Uniqlo. I really like rib knit tops because I have really narrow hips and ribbed knits can kind of give my body a little bit more definition and balance because it conforms to my body. I'm also wearing these sweatpants from Aritzia, which I love because they're not like regular sweatpants, they're cargo sweatpants. They're really thick, 
really durable and really warm, which was great because it was pretty cold that day. Now let's get into this jewelry situation. I'm wearing the Riva Diamond pre-stacked ring from Monica Vinader. I love how intricate yet simple the design of this ring is. I think it has a gorgeous blend of complexity and understated elegance. I think it's a statement on its own, so I wore it by itself. For my necklace stack, I'm wearing the Juno Fine Chain Necklace with the Dea Beaded Pendant Charm, which are both 18 karat gold vermeil. One thing to know about Monica Vinader is that they sell both chains and pendants, so you can actually just mix and match and create your own necklace style. And the necklace behind it is, of course, my Buddha necklace that you've already seen for the past two years from my local Asian jeweler. <laughs> I love a gold chunky hoop. These are the Siren Muse Chunky Medium Hoop Earrings, also in 18 karat gold vermeil. Again, I love the irregularities of the surface. It's not smooth, so it adds a lot of character and makes it unique from a lot of other chunky gold hoops. I threw my Acne Studios overcoat on top. You guys know how much I love this coat. I definitely got my money's worth. I wear this coat at least once a week. To keep it cozy, I'm wearing my low Uggs, and to keep it casual, I'm wearing the TikTok viral bag from Uniqlo. After we did some work in the co-working space, we checked out Donald Glover's new boba shop in Silver Lake, and I just wore the same outfit. It all worked out. On Tuesday, I just ran a couple of errands. This is another one of my daily uniforms. I have repeated this outfit so many times. It's just so chic, but still very comfortable. So I love wearing this to run errands or grab a coffee or quick lunch with friends. I'm wearing an Oxford cloth button up shirt from Polo Ralph Lauren. I believe this is the slim fit style. And I like wearing this university stripe pattern for this outfit because it adds some subtle visual interest because the outfit itself is pretty basic. Layering is one of the biggest reasons why I love fall and winter fashion so much. I just love the way layered clothing looks. So I layered a wool blend sweater on top of this Oxford. This one is from Uniqlo. And look how effortlessly put together this looks. And it's so easy to do. You just layer an oversized sweater on top of an Oxford button up. And it eats every single time. On the bottom, I'm wearing these low-rise baggy jeans. I love low-rise jeans specifically because I have a very short torso and low-rise pants can elongate my torso and make me look more balanced overall. Just a little hack for all the short torso girlies out there. This crescent-shaped crossbody bag is from Pauline. And for my rings, I'm wearing the Dea domed ring and a Riva diamond pre-stacked ring. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not the biggest fan of bracelets unless they're bangles. I love bangles. If you look at my jewelry collection, 99% of all of the bracelets that I own are bangles. I just like that they hold their shape and they don't get in the way like tennis bracelets do, for example. Obviously, this is just personal preference. I'm very particular about my likes and dislikes in fashion. I know myself very well. <laughs> but this bangle is the essential bangle from Monica Vinader. It's 18 karat gold vermeil. Again, I love how bold it is while maintaining its elegance. It's very chic and I love the contrast between the elegance of the bracelet and the oversizedness of the sweater. I just really like that juxtaposition. On Wednesday, I just got my nails done, so I wanted to wear a super casual outfit that wasn't too fussy. I'm wearing a basic tight-fitting t-shirt, those same low-rise Uniqlo jeans, and this red knit cardigan from a brand called Maj. I love this cardigan in particular because a lot of knit cardigans are open knit and they don't keep me very warm. I like this one because it's tight knit and it's pretty thick without being chunky. And I love how it's structured and holds its own shape. It's not slouchy like a lot of cardigans are designed to be. So this looks a little more put together to me. And there's nothing like a nice set of rings to go with your fresh manicure. So I'm wearing the same ring combo as yesterday, the Dea domed ring and the Riva diamond pre-stacked ring along with the essential bangle and the 
June fine chain necklace with the Dea beaded pendant charm. The key to elevate basic outfits is truly by accessorizing. Even if the accessories themselves are simple, collectively they just add another layer to your outfit which creates more visual interest making you look more elegant or put together how many times am i going to say put together in this video <laughs> On Thursday, I filmed a video for my YouTube channel. Now, I'm gonna be completely transparent with you folks. I filmed a talking head video, and since all you could see in the video was the top half of my body, I was actually just wearing sweatpants when I filmed this. <laughs> but for the sake of this video, I just went ahead and styled a full outfit for you guys, just for y'all. This knit cardigan is from Sandro. I love the gold buttons on this sweater. Y'all, look how much sunlight I lost while filming this video. This is crazy. On the bottom, I'm wearing those same pleated trousers. As you guys can tell, there is a small curated collection of pieces that I re-wear all the time because they're comfortable, I like the way they look, and they're versatile. You can mix and match and get a lot out of your closet this way. Coming up with a daily uniform or signature style for everyday wear can save you a lot of money and decision fatigue in the morning. And I actually have a video coming up about this exact topic, so make sure to subscribe if you're not already so that you don't miss it. I am a loafer girly. I love loafers. I am a ballet flat hater. I hate ballet flats. So loafers are my version of flats. <laughs> you will never catch me in ballet flats. I just really love loafers because they're really structured and it's just giving wealthy. I look like I'm on my way to brunch with the girls at the country club. To match my loafers, I'm wearing the same bag from Fossil and I'm wearing all of my Monica Vinader rings today. Again, you can use code AsiaJ20 for 20% off your entire purchase and I will link every single piece of jewelry featured in this video in the description box down below. On Friday, I had a self-tape audition. Now, for those of you that are new here, I am a professional actress and I actively audition for TV and film. For today's audition, I'm playing a character that is a tennis player. So I did end up getting to wear the full Lacoste fit, y'all. We started the week with half the fit and ended the week with the full fit. You love to see it, folks. And Lacoste is a tennis brand and this is literally an outfit for playing tennis. So everything just worked out perfectly for me this week. And I'm wearing those same Adidas. I'm getting a lot of wear out of these shoes. And that's pretty much the outfit, but here's a little sneak peek of my audition. <laughs> LOL. And I'm not ashamed to say that creating the look for my characters is my favorite part of auditioning. Not the acting, the fashion. <laughs> so that was my whole week in outfits, folks. I tried a different format of this type of video because I got some complaints on my last one saying that the camera was shaking too much and it made them dizzy. So let me know in the comments if you like this format better. Also, let me know in the comments which outfit is your fave. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you again, Monica Vinader, for sponsoring today's video. And I'll catch you guys in my next fashion video.